Hey you guys, we're going to make a gift basket and this is going to be for my godchild. His birthday is coming up and I grabbed this little cute basket at the dollar store. Oh, look how cute it is. I thought this would be perfect in case you guys want to see. So I'm going to use that basket. You can use whatever you want, obviously. But it's his birthday and I thought this would be adorable to use. So we're going to put it like that. I have a couple things I want to add to it. So the first thing I am adding to this basket is a box of chocolates. And this one fits perfect. This is the little one of the Ferrera. And this one fits. Look at how perfect that fits. Like if that basket was made for this box of chocolates. So it fits perfect. I was so excited. When I saw it, I'm like, this fits amazing. I'm going to add, he's a teenager, this music trivia, and it has a hundred um, quiz questions. I thought this was so cool, and it's a 50 um, card, but look at the questions. Isn't that cool? So this is going to go perfect right there on the side. I am also adding these foot wipes because he's always walking around barefoot at my sister's house. So these are just like foot wipes and you just wipe your feet down if you feel it's dirty. I thought this was cool. <laughs> You're probably like, what? Okay, so that is adorable already. I'm going to add a deodorant on there because he's already a teenager. So I wanted to add more like grown-up stuff, not so like baby stuff anymore. I'm going to add a coconut. Um, I love this one hydration and this is a lotion i thought this was so cute i can add it right here as well i think right there i don't want it to fall i am adding the dove body care as well i thought this was a good one they have the men's one too but he's a teenager i wasn't sure if i wanted to like you know Something stopping it from going in. Oh, I know what it is. It's the box. So how cute is that? Just a cute little basket for him to enjoy on his birthday. I thought I would make something really cute. Something little. Nothing too much, you know. I made this gift card holder. And it says, happy birthday. So I'm just going to add the money in there. Whatever amount you add is optional. Look how perfect the money goes in right there. So this right here is really perfect. And I want to add it right there on the side. So you can add it wherever you want. I'm adding it right there. I thought this little basket is so adorable. I wanted to add a hand sanitizer, but I could tell it's not going to fit. And I don't want to force anything on a basket that's just not going to fit. So it's that simple. It's a cute little basket. Nothing big. You know, not too much, not too little. <laughs> I'll be using these adorable bags that you pick up at the dollar store. And you get a two of them for a dollar. 25 I think that's what it is now. So I like this basket. I'm going to use it again. I bought another one in case something comes up. I thought it was a great little cute basket. You can put um, something in the bottom if you want. You can do so many things with it. I'm going to go ahead and put it in here. And we're just going to wrap it up. So it has a little bit of everything. A little bit of chocolate. A little bit of money. How cute is that? Now I want to put it right in the middle. Because I don't want... Can you guys see? Yeah. Anything falling off. So I'm going to do the same thing I always do. I'm going to get it clear tape and I'm going to tape the back of it. I am just going to fold it in like so. Bring it around. I'm going to tape the back of it. Make sure your tape is clear. I mean, it doesn't have to be, but it looks really nice when it is clear. 
at least I think it does. So look at how pretty that's going to look already, like fitted. So I'm going to turn it around. I'm going to fold the inside as well. And I'm going to bring it around. Did you guys see what I did? I know a lot of you guys say, oh, your hand's in the way, but what am I supposed to do with my hands, you guys? They're my hands. Okay, that is adorable. Now, I'll be using a regular blue ribbon. You can use whatever color you want. I thought this would be a great color since it'll match the bow. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to grab our ribbon. I'm going to grab some scissors. I'm going to grab it like so. Half of the ribbon, obviously. And I'm going to make the knot. I'm like that. I'm going to make a little bow. Like so. And how cute is that? Now one little trick and tip that I can give you is I want it to be long so I'm not going to cut it all out. So that's perfect. And I'm going to cut it at an angle. Just because I already cut the other one at an angle, I kind of want to cut both of them. Now I'm going to grab... Now let me just show you really quick. One of my little secrets is that I grab the top of it and I cut a third off. Like that. I know it looks kind of funny, but trust me, once you fluff it up, look how cute that basket is. And just like that, I have an adorable gift basket that I could take to someone's birthday. He's going to love it. It has a little bit of chocolate, a little bit of money. It has a little bit of everything so what do you guys think hopefully he likes it and yeah comment down below make sure you guys subscribe to my channel give me a thumbs up then until next time bye you guys